What's up guys, J Dog Tech Help here and I got another Mac theme for you guys. Now this one's you're gonna have to work to get this one. And you're gonna have by what I mean by work is you're gonna have to download just a little extra. But it's fine to get this theme. Now this is a white taskbar with the blue start orb, which gives back the feel of the old Mac themes. This even incorporates the hide hide and show button and the non glossy Mac start orbs. Now this is a good classic theme and it is very good with the stone line wallpaper. The rocket dock you're going to have to download yourself and the theme for it you're going to have to download. But this is a Windows line themes and, and it's very easy to get so I'm going to go ahead and get started and showing you guys how to get it. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to open up Google and you're going to type in window lines and then seven I would use Safari for this but Camtasia just makes it lag horribly so alright so you're going to go to the one that says Stardot Corporation and this has a 30 day trial. It's Windows Bar 7.3. So once this loads up, if it ever feels like loading up, you're going to hit free download. And you take it to this page where you hit it again. Now while that's downloading, we're going to go ahead and get another couple of extra steps out the way. We're going to go back to Google. Type in Snow Leopard HD and paper. And I'm gonna go to images and you're gonna go through this one right here. This this nice pretty white background right here. You're going to download this. And now you're going to go back to Google for the third time and type in Rocket Dock. This will be one of the last steps we have to do. Now, if some of y'all are egging about that 30 day trial for Windows Blinds, there is a crack in the patch out for it. You can torrent it or you can YouTube it or you can Google it. I know there is one because I've looked for one, but I don't need it because I'm probably not going to have this for 30 days anyway. So you're going to go to download, download Rocket Dock, and while that's downloading, you're going to go to get add-ons, skins, and you're going to type in Lion. Scroll to the third page, fourth, excuse me, and you'll see this one, the original taskbar, or dock, and the blue version if you want it to match completely hit that and if you hit that again it'll just show you a picture of what it looks like but you can hit download and you're going to go to your downloads folder and you're going to install rocket dock now when you install rocket dock you're going to want to use that theme I am going to go ahead and zoom and you're going to go to your local disk program files look for rocket dock go to skins and you're going to need WinRAR in order to extract the skin theme make sure you extract it in its name so you won't have to put it in the folder and you're just going to drag and drop it and to select it right click dock settings you're going to go to style and you're going to choose your theme now here's another thing you want to do in general run it startup and position screen position bottom layering layering make sure it's always on bottom the quality doesn't really have to be all that great see this just isn't really you can tell after a certain a certain bit but the reason my dog's going slow is because I'm recording with Camtasia. 
change your opa opacity down to around 80 or 90 size 41 pixels so you can fit more on there hit ok and now you're going to install windows binds and it's going to ask you to reboot it always does so when you reboot you're going to go back to your internet browser and you're going to go to win customize.com now when you get here you're going to go right here where it says all go to this windows volume and type in mac you're going to go to this one it says windows Vine, windows ox x tyler tiger now this isn't going to work because when you open this it's just going to show a deformed image and you're not going to see the download so you're going to go to this mac os x the difference is this x is spaced from the other one you're going to hit download and you're going to open windows blinds and drag the theme in there or I'll show you an alternate. Go to your downloads. Scroll for it. Uh, I don't have any more. I seem to have deleted my last theme because they're already in here. But you can double click it and uninstall it and you can select it. Now, Windows Blinds comes with default themes and it saves your arrow theme if you're using. Windows 7 and it saves your regular theme if you're using Windows Vista. Windows XP, you can't really change much on that, but it saves it anyway. And you're just going to double click that and customize everything to your liking. Adding separators and adding your images and whatnot. Now, that was how to get that theme. Um, stay tuned for my unboxing video. I will be unboxing a Nikon Coolpix S3100 pretty soon and be doing a video quality test on that and giving you a review on that but thanks for watching this video and until next time i'll see you guys later